a kitten internet. Yeah. Um, we haven't really done anything other than take a break in between. In fact, Starfield's still running from the last video. Mission updated exorcism. Yes, the last one was ghost hunt. Ah, okay, this makes sense. Now we need to talk to people, including Andresia. So, let's talk with the awesome person Did first. Did I mention thanks for taking well, these two on? Your power. Be careful with those goons. Although, for each of these... What's up? Yeah. I wish you want to, to talk negotiation it. strategies? When I'll you have as best I can. Don't worry, Andresia, I, I will. my fair share of their kind over the years. You don't get into that job to make it rich. You get into it to be your own boss and prove how tough you are. So, my advice? Let them know that pushing around a bunch of counselors just makes them look like bullies, not tough. Watch yourself. Uh, thank you again for doing this. I'm counting the moments until it's all over. Damn it, Liam. I think you should offer them money, and I'm willing to help. Here, all I have liquid at the moment. Hopefully it'll be enough. Oh, it is okay. not. Okay, uh, that's not going to be enough money. I I'd hand them those much. credits I gave you. I'm hoping that much will be sufficient. There's no way that's Take going care. to be enough. Please. How much money do you have, by the way? Not that much, if I remember right. Yeah. No, you have enough. Not much, though. Are you looking for my suggestion? I don't think they're going to respect anything other than force. But I think Sloane's not going to be happy if you handle it that way. You Why are your toes Mr. having issues? They're fused together. Yeah. I would hate for anyone else to get hurt in all this. So please, try to solve things peacefully. Love, I can only guess at what these two might be after. But it's clear they perceive something about us as a threat. They're afraid. And all you can do with fear is try and understand it. So, just listen to them, okay? Hear what they have to say. And see if you can make whatever it is they're worried about a little less scary. With bullets. Wait. Good luck out there. And the final person to talk with. I wanted to thank you for giving me the chance to work with you. I know we met under um, unusual circumstances. You seem to That's be acclimating well to Constellation. Are you enjoying working with them? I mean, I get some pretty sweet powers, and I was a miner before this. Just saying. I didn't get to read the second. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the pay's not great, but the people are all right. None of us are in this for the credits. You have certainly become a vital part of the organization. That is a credit to your abilities. And if powers. I may, from what you have seen, do you think I fit in well with the rest of Constellation? I like how all three of them are basically, no, you don't fit in. <laughs> but don't worry about it. Yes. Um, fitting in's overrated. Perhaps, but it is still important to me. I feel as though I am often looking in at the rest of the group. I do not like this feeling. I would like to feel that I am a valued member of the organization, but I am concerned that I am off-putting, or my actions have alienated me. I have not shared much, but everyone knows I worked with smugglers for years. I am no stranger to violence and death. I mean, the others aren't either. Mm -hmm. Sounds like fun! <laughs> I 
<laughs> I might not admit this to the others, but at times, it was. <sighs> I do not regret this, but I do know how it makes me seem. For those that have not lived it, it can be difficult to imagine or accept. Others here have seen conflict, but for more noble causes. Uh, Vladimir is the about only to say. one here who can begin to <laughs> Vladimir understand. Vladimir definitely it. has not. He was the one who hey, pressed the group to include me. I lack his charm. He puts others at ease. I fear my presence does the opposite. Time to flirt with people? Yeah. But... Flirting is always the option, but I'm still going to mass over all the options. Uh, that is kind of you. You also have a lot <laughs> going. Uh, I am. I, I find expressing affection difficult, but um, but truly. Thank you. I know this seems trivial, uh, perhaps childish. I have just always relied only on myself. I have never been surrounded by people like this. By a group I... I wish to be a part of. Does that make sense? Thank you. That is reassuring. Discussing these things is challenging for me. I hope now you can better understand why I wanted to keep the circumstances of our meeting quiet. I wanted to thank you for not saying anything to Vladimir. You said you were considering it, and I appreciate that you decided against it. I do not wish to be seen as a source of violence and nothing else. Yet yeah, all of your skills are violence related. Well, theft isn't violent. I suppose, but you can't use theft in the mm -hmm. game from an NPC. Indeed it was. And now I hope you can see why. Thank you for talking this over with me. It is good to know that at least one member of Constellation understands me. Okay, now let's go talk to some ghosts. Or exercise them. Exercise them, maybe? Ah! Andresha, we don't need to be that close, I'm just saying. Well, you can just fast travel there, at least. Oh, it's the same location? Yep. Gotcha. And since we cut the wall, it's just walk in the back in. door. Gotcha. How you doing, Internet? That's the front door. Where's the back door at? No, that's the door. Oh, that's right. It's yeah, I remember now. Literally, that there is a back door in here. In this room, specifically. You don't need to think. I wanna. All right, I'll sit down on this couch. Seems a little weird to me. You can get up now. Andresha? It's time. What the? Who's that? You. Who are you and what the hell are you doing here? 
And just who the holy hell are you? I'm playing a nice character, so I'm here on behalf of the Yellow's Retreat. Want to talk? See? I told you Kilman was going to lead them to us. Should have slit his throat when we had the chance. Quiet. You're a ray of sunshine. Listen, unless you're here to tell us those convicts have decided to close up shop, then we've got nothing to discuss. Why do you care, anyway? I couldn't care less about the cons. They can huff fish innards until they rot for all we care. But this retreat, if they actually succeed, keep criminals out of the bounty system? Yeah, I well, was wondering if it was that. The galaxy probably doesn't need so many trackers at that point, does it? And then maybe the big boys like the UC and the Collective set up programs of their own, just like Elios. Put us all out of a job. Now, better to nip it in the bud now before it becomes a threat. Which is why I'm not interested in discussing anything except the date and time they're shutting their doors. How much is it going to cost? Yeah. More than you can offer. Only way this stops is if that place closes up for good. <laughs> Let's try persuasion. If you fail, you don't get the option of pain. Really? I just did this on one of my characters. Hmm. It is a reasonable request. You would do well to consider it. Can you That's so. See, you don't get it. What? That's... that's not what this is. We're tough. We Just haven't really persuade. made a lot of headway. Fine. We'll leave the retreat alone. Can't make any promises about us being the last, though. Just get out, all right? Ah. What? The two times I've done this, uh, the woman had a mag sniper. Mm. But I guess you're too low level for them yep. to appear. That's an Orion? Looked like it. The retreat safe. From us no. no, that's uh, AA ninety one, is it? I'm pretty sure that's a Maelstrom, isn't it? No, you can always just uh click her in the console and um I uh, that's not her. Scroll wheel. No. That that one, the NPC blank. And I N B. It is a maelstrom. Yeah, that's what I thought. Hmm. Maybe a heavily modded maelstrom, but it's still a maelstrom. Oh. Well, we're done here. So the only difference was basically persuade versus spending a lot of money. Mm -hmm. I haven't gone with the spending the money option yet, so oh. I don't know if. If you get that back later, but... Why don't I reload and find out, then? If you want to. I mean, I still have a third character who's going to be doing this soon. J just go with it. No, I'm gonna go with it, because that's eight minutes ago. Mm -hmm. The last save. So, not worth the... Yeah, exit this time. Oh. Just curious. I just thought that 20k seems like a lot of money given that I only have 45k. It's half of my money. But there's something in the dialogue later that made me think that I was probably going to get it back if I spent it. Mm. Or at least partially. Partial refund. I'm not picking up a rivet until all this gets fixed.
There you are. You were gone for quite a while, love. I was? Are you oh, alive? yeah, I guess I did wait. Were you able to find our trackers? <laughs> you may begin heaping praise upon me whenever you would like. Your tracker problem is no more. It, It's done? Well, I guess I better get started. You are one of the most reliable souls I've come across in a long time. This place, all of us, we are in your debt. There is just one last piece of business, though. Nevin asked to speak to you in private. He's waiting for you up in the office. Did you grab the magazine in here? I can't remember because that was before. I don't remember. Uh, you can check if you have it in your inventory. Which magazine is it? Uh, New Atlantean... Oh. Uh, you have number one. Which one was that? Yeah, that's one from Tau City. Okay. So, it's in a bedroom. Which I have not been to any of the bedrooms. Oh, uh, there are heat ditches there. You should kill them. Where? In there. At least there were heat ditches when I was here, but that was, uh... Uh, you should be able to find them with sandstar stuff. But there might not be heat ditches for you because right. you've completed the Vanguard plotline. No. Nope. I don't see them. They do not exist. So, people are being more diligent about heat leech disposal. That's good. I like it when I see things actually match. Things actually have consequences. Yeah. I think, yeah. That one. This one? I think so. Yep, there it is. But, nice that. New Atlantean 04. Beer brought... Platter. Ah, uh, something from my adopted home of Wisconsin. Abiding alongside you is ah, never there you are. Dull. So, first things first, I need to say, well, thank you. His eyes look sad. Yeah, that's probably from them mocapping Liam O'Brien. He always looks sad. <laughs> Glad to be of service. And we are exceedingly grateful for it. It's just... The situation you set right, with the trackers, it's one we don't want to find ourselves in again. Luckily, we have someone, our founding donor in fact, who has offered to reach out to the Alliance, ensure their good behavior going forward. Before she does, however, she's asked for the details of what exactly occurred. I've already shared my own insights, but, well, she wants to talk to you, too. Is that something you might be amenable to? Who exactly am I going to be talking to? Our benefactor has said she'd prefer to do the introductions herself. But you can rest assured she wants only to thank you in person. Hear your side of the story. Nothing more sinister than that. Okay, I can do that. Ah, she'll be pleased to hear it. Head to Aquila City in the Cheyenne system. Check in with Justin Sneed, her security chief. And I would ask you to try and be polite. She's the only reason we're here. Good old Sneed. Sneed's feed and seeds. That was a Simpsons joke from a very long time ago. Because the story used to be called Chucks. You can just fast travel with your ship. Yeah, but my ship's right there. Mm. Although I am overburdened. Oh, oh, I'm not overburdened. But I think I need to be training oxygen a little bit more. Maybe. I'm going to 
that. I meant to hit up hit, I didn't. Always a satisfying moment. But it's right there. Yeah. But I'm actually going to sleep. I'm listening. Yes? Hello, Sarah. Hello, Barrett. Cargo, uncargo. Dumb. Dumb. Oh, you still have the star parcel package. Mm hmm. Wasn't that going to Aquila? I don't remember anymore. I think so. Remember to um, take stuff back from Andreja. Yep. And the second. Those. What did you need? I am happy to help. And it was the heavy particle fuse that I have to keep. That's her, yeah, that's her default. And I wanted to keep the med packs. And she has credits for you. Indeed I do. All yours. You've just been picking people's pockets while I've been Very gone. Good. How would that even work? Like, you would have to take their entire cred stick. Or is there a way to, like, siphon up a few credits here and a few credits there? I don't know. Hmm? Do you need something? No. But why are you talking through your helmet? All right, to Aquila City, apparently. Time to join the stars. Let's not. Let's just go to the stars and not join them. We're all star stuff, after all. We don't need to join them. Apogee kick complete. Orbit steady. Is that the star partial ship? The, yeah. Yes. Question is, will they ever make outposts useful? Now, is it this ship services technician that is getting the star parcel package? Or was it another one? We're asking everyone to take care of any leeches on their ships. We don't want any Terramore storming through here. Anything I can help you with? Not this one. I'm gonna switch quests over to it because... No. It would be miscellaneous. Ah, it's out. Needs feed and seed. Ah, uh, the slowdown. Nobody's Why kill a city? Why? I kill a city rather well. Perhaps better than I would like. Really? I was not expecting Andresha to know a kill a city very well. I mean, there is a trade authority here, so. True. So it is a smuggler hub, but. Tower's closed. Come back some other time. Fine. Walk away. Things I would do if I had power like, like I that. said, 
Tower is closed. <laughs> Stold didn't check with you. I'm Brainic. I'm the one who helped out the Illus retreat. Hmm. You're them, huh? I've got two rules for this little meeting. Rule number one. You're not to share anything you discuss up there. This is a private matter, and we're going to keep it that way. Rule two. You decide to get playful with that weapon, we're going to have serious problems. Think you can abide by those? <laughs> Good. Miss Lance is waiting upstairs. You can go on up. Can I? I don't know if you'll let me through. And that must make you our guest. Please, take Use a seat. Use the power of course, I think. Now, you may already know who I am. Raisha Lance, CEO Laredo Firearms. And you I know all about. I can't thank you enough for everything you've done for the retreat. Truly, it's a project that's near and dear to my heart. Light is flickering in the game. Ah. You're the person responsible for the retreat? The CEO of a weapons manufacturer. I'm not the sole donor, but yes, the retreat is a project I've been trying to foster for some time now. My attempt to improve the plight of humanity, even if just in a minor way. Which is why I'm so thankful for your intervention on its behalf. Well, I suppose you're quite welcome. Now, I presume Nevin already got you up to speed. I need details before I talk to the heads of the Trackers Alliance. Make sure their members understand the retreat's off-limits. So if you don't mind, I'd like to just jump right into it. Lily here will be taking notes as we go. Now, Nevin said all the various incidents afflicting the retreat, they all stemmed from this pair of rogue bounty hunters. Do I have that right? What sort of other incidents are you talking about? There were a streak of thefts and accidents leading up to Mr. Kilman's kidnapping. We'd presume they were just bad luck or local fauna. Ixel's not exactly the most hospitable of worlds, but Nevin made it sound as if those bounty hunters might have been responsible for it all. And I was hoping you could confirm if that was the case or not. Hmm. Well, I mean... It was supposed to be in the slate, but mm -hmm. we only have confirmation of that from one person. Yeah, you only have what Monica said, not right. reading it firsthand, so... So, I suppose all we can confirm is that they were involved in the kidnapping. The rest, I wasn't present for. Yeah, the rest is secondhand information. Yep. Ah, I'll be sure that's noted. But you did manage to get those two to leave the retreat alone. You mind my asking how you accomplished that? I asked nicely. They were adults. I had to wrap around my little finger before I barely opened my mouth. But no, this is the nice character, so I just talked to them. Got them to see reason. Two trackers and you just talked them down? That's quite the feat. I'm interested in the details, though. How exactly did it all play out? Well... I'm a tough negotiator. Those two are lucky I didn't talk them into flying into themselves into a star. It was sort of a tough back and mm -hmm. forth, though. So that's probably what I'm going to answer. I'm sure it was. I've dealt with trackers. They tend to be a focused sort. So only other thing I wanted to ask, and I'm just looking for an opinion here... Is there anything in your eyes that could have been done to prevent this happening? The subtitles didn't match what she said. I didn't even notice. The subtitles said prevent this kidnapping. Oh. She said prevent this happening. From mm. happening. What she said is probably more accurate. I'm 
Let's see. No. That's definitely not right. The retreat is not actually that underprotected. They have turrets. Yeah. It's just the fact that they had some very, very good people, good in terms of killing people, involved. Honestly, I don't think their leadership needs guidance. Mm. Take as many as you need. Their leadership actually seemed to be doing a reasonable job. If, yeah. Maybe not with the construction crew themselves, but that was actually not the problem in this case. Mm-hmm. It's like... They just need more people, because if you hadn't come along, then nothing would have happened, yeah. because... So in that case, maybe it is that the retreat is woefully underprotected. Mm -hmm. I it's wouldn't not say woefully, but yeah, they could use a few more people. I don't agree with that mm -hmm. this at all, and I also don't agree that they're on the right course though, because again, if we hadn't stepped in, mm -hmm. nothing would have happened, and not just because this nothing is a Bethesda wrong. game and nothing happens around us. I didn't offend you, did I? No. I think the retreat's a little unprotected, underprotected. You need more security. Honestly, you probably more just need more people in general. After everything I've heard from you and Nevin, I'm inclined to agree. It'll take time to get the right people in place for this kind of work, but I'll make sure it's addressed. But that should give me enough to present to the Alliance. Thank you for making the time. Now, what you did... Well, it deserves something more than just a couple of firm thank yous. Here, I want you to have these. Oh, I get guns? They're a rare make, but I think you've earned it. Now, was there anything oh, else you wanted to talk about before we went our separate ways? And helmet. Hmm. Peacemaker. Yeah. And some ammo. Uh, let's see. How are you gonna get the Tracker's Alliance to play ball anyway? You make lots of friends in my position. Friends in the Free Star Collective. Friends in the UC. The sort of people with influence over things. Like, say, how much a locality is allowed to spend on Alliance contracts each quarter. <laughs> when the Alliance heads grasp that it's better for us all to be friends, I expect they'll leave the retreat well enough alone. So, what made you get involved in the retreat in the first place? It's something that's been on my mind for a while now. How best to help the galaxy's incarcerated population? Humanities try plenty of bad ideas. Throwing them in jail and forgetting about them. The UC gave that a go way back when. Took all their criminals to a penal colony on Suvorov and left them to their own devices. Well, those folks didn't appreciate that sort of treatment. Took over the mm -hmm. colony. And now we call them the Crimson Fleet. Next, we tried making them pay fines instead of going to jail. Except if you don't have the money, that's no sort yep. of improvement at all, is it? Bad Things idea awful, after anyway. bad idea. I thought it was time we tried something new. That's where the plans for the retreat came from. Our attempt at doing things different. Yeah, fines just means that it's legal for rich people. Yep, and there are enough rich people in the settled systems where... That's absolutely the case. I think you're on the right track. You can do real good with the retreat. That's kind of you. But without your help, it might have stayed just a goal. You have my sincere thanks. Now if you'll excuse me, as you've seen, there's plenty to be done. And a little bit more money. Mm -hmm. Have a look at that suit because it had an effect that I've never seen on anything else before. Antiseptic refined peacemaker spacesuit. Peacemaker rifles do ten percent more damage. Now, if only the other attributes on it were better, like mechanized. Uh huh. I mean, I don't currently have mechanized anyway. Mhm. Mm what about the pack? It's just a balanced boost pack. A decently nice one, but. But it doesn't have any effects. Yeah, and I have a fastened boost pack right now. Mm -hmm. How about the helm? 
just a normal helm. It's a nice helm, but there are no enchantments. On the other hand, there are no enchantments. My current one is not bad, but not great either. It's good that there's three of them, but neither of them are a must-have. Right. And also look at the weight difference between them. Hmm. And Peacemaker. Of course it is. So, it's a faster attacking rifle. Except that it has the same problem that every quest reward in this game has. It's the base weapon. Is it though? Look at the DPS. That's the base weapon. There is no way oh, yeah. that is the upgraded version. I mean, peacemakers have kind of slow fire rate. Yeah. But... And, and that's already poorly modded. Yes. So yeah, I would say that this might be the... Am I just really... Oh, that's right, I'm sitting. Um... It might be the case where it might be worth reloading repeatedly for there. For your other characters, I mean. The, ones that, the one that left that hasn't done it. Because the actual unique part of the enchantment is really good. Like, 10% fire speed on rifles on armor is awesome. Damage. Damage. Uh, switch to the quest uh, false positives. Why are you... I was clicking on it, it wasn't working. Mm -hmm. False positives. Yep. Because it has definitely been a day at this point. It has been many days. Yes. But all that matters is that it's been one. Ah, uh, the slowdown! <laughs> That's where Enhance is here. It's not like it's a place I need to go very often. Would someone really tamper with the data intentionally? I just don't see uh -oh. any other explanation. Oh, it's you. I got the data from the seismic sensors, and I, I, I need help. Nothing that would get you in trouble this time. Promise. Well, I didn't get in trouble last time, so it's fine. Um, what do you need? I need someone to go talk to Davis Wilson. He isn't speaking to me. None of the security folks are, actually. <laughs> I mean, I'd be happy to help if I can. Oh, thank you. It's really nice to hear that when others just don't seem to care. Remember the sensors you helped me set up around the city? Well, Davis Wilson is pretty angry about it. I suppose I should have expected that, but now no one involved with security is willing to talk to me. At all. And I really need to coordinate with them because the data I'm getting from the sensors is, well, it's off. Not what I expected at all. Oh, what's wrong with the data? Kinda everything. The timing of the results, the strength of the signals. I did a lot of research on the Ashta before I started this project, and none of it lines up like it should. I mean, maybe your tech isn't working properly. No, the tech is fine. I never would have put it out there if I had any reservations about that. Look, I know I screwed up here. I went behind Davis's back and did what he told me not to. I don't expect him to talk to me. But this, I'm not gonna lie. It looks an awful lot like someone has been purposely messing with the system. I can't just stroll up and accuse him of anything, but maybe someone, you I'm thinking, could just Ask sure. around, see if something is going on. I'd really appreciate it. <sighs> no. 
that's not actually passable, apparently. But, but, parkour! Keep it moving. People around here think we own Aquila. They're wrong. The Ashta do. Don't mean to be rude, but I got a lot of things on my plate right now, so... <laughs> oh, did you now? And did that perhaps come from a certain entitled so-called inventor who's caused me no end of headaches? She's just worried about the results that she's getting. Oh, is she? After going off and doing exactly what she was told not to, she's concerned now? She made my life a lot more difficult, but I don't have time to deal with that right now. I have more important things to worry about. Been tracking Ashta for a long time now, and suddenly their behavior doesn't add up. Probably not a coincidence. The sensors passively collect data. There's no way they could have caused this. You don't even need zoology to know that. That's just obvious. That... That makes sense. But something's got them riled up. Now, I need to get back out there and get some eyes on this situation. Since you're so interested, looks like you can handle yourself. You want to join me? <laughs> yeah, I've heard more than a few hunters say something similar. They nearly all apologize for it I later. I fought terror morphs. Gear yourself up however you need to and meet me at the gate. We'll head out from there. We pull out the Ashta Tamer, apparently. I probably wouldn't use that since that's explosive and you. Oh, I'm gonna be with people, aren't I? Mm hmm. That's... You fools, you have the gate right. open! You ready to head out there? Well, you certainly brought enough enthusiasm for the both of us. Just stick close to me, keep your head on a swivel, and you'll be fine. And maybe we'll get some answers. Everything good? We're here to help. Are you going to come through? Thank you. Close your damn doors. This is what I'm talking about. These tracks, they're all wrong. The space and the depth, this doesn't make any sense. Let's keep going. And as usual, Bethesda NPCs run very slowly. The Ashta are clever, but they're usually predictable. These tracks don't follow any of the paths I expect them to. It just doesn't add up. Looks like the tracks head this way. Go on. What in the hell? This is one of our security box. Someone sent this thing out to mimic the Ashton? Why in the world? 
Shit. You hear that? Eyes up. We got incoming. We do? Ah. Careful not to point that thing at me. Be careful not Stay to get in close. the way. Stay safe. Where are the other two? Mm -hmm. Right next to the robot. Oh. That's one of them. Where's the other one? You already looted two. There were four, weren't there? I thought there were just three. Oh, maybe I'm mistaken. know how to handle yourself. Most times someone encounters an ash that they panic. Not you. I've now fought I even more terror questions. more. Who in the hell did this and why? No, I expect not. Someone from Aquila Security did this. We're the only ones that have access to these robots or can change their orders. I need to check this over, see if I can find some more details. But while I do that, I need you to run back to the city. Check the access logs on the computer in the barracks. Look for whoever signed for this thing last. I'll meet you in the city when I'm done here. Well, obviously, it's a member of the Achilles security force that's trying to cover up cracks over something that they're doing that would have shown up on her sensors. I thought this was one of the doorways. The other door. Whoever sabotaged the robot is in for. Come on. Get all the way in. Close your stupid doors. Something to report? Yeah, you guys are idiots. Just saying. Yeah, they should have like a script where if the door I actually has met been a guy open, who the red mile. Mm -hmm. he lost for an eye in the process, more than but he did walk away with a normal pile of time to go through the door, that, mean, then the guard would just close eyes, the door, right? No, I don't want to go to the red pile. But it's so fun. But I don't know if you remember. I'm trying to finish the game up and not you know. do all of these side quests. Have you even been here to no. Red Mile with this character? Nope. I don't believe I have. <laughs> Little Miss Emily caught an actual pickpocket. Gave her a sticker. Didn't go over well. I'm not six! B. Kirkland. If it weren't for the walls, the whole town would be an Ashta buffet. Oh, hey there. Back already. Davis said something about you going on patrol with him? He's... <clears throat> he's alright, isn't he? Nothing, uh, hmm. bad happened out there. I wonder if her scars are from an Ashta attack. That would probably be it. Yeah, he's not going to be happy when he hears that you're the one who sent the robot out there. Oh, no. Look, 
People getting hurt was never part of it. Davis has just been so stressed over this whole thing with that woman and her sensors, and it's been affecting him on the job. The damn robot was just supposed to stomp around, mess up her data, and then come back. I didn't know it would rile up the Ashta so much, and it wasn't supposed to break down. <laughs> I mean, I can ask the Ace Vist to go easy on you, but, uh, yeah, you definitely done goofed. It won't matter. I really screwed this up. You could at least be thankful that leniency is being offered. And then back over to the other side of the slowdown city. Slowdown city! Wonder when Bethesda will finally patch where the city doesn't slow to an absolute crawl constantly. Like, there's nothing visually that should cause this to happen. We should be on our guard if we venture outside the city. The Ashta are quite formidable. They are. I got nothing on the red mile we molars. Need to get to the you will never grow tired of seeing that. The robot's internals are fried, so I came up empty. You have any better luck than I did? Know who's responsible? Yep, it's truth time. You serious? Oh, Bailey, what were you thinking? My own people sabotaging equipment. Whole world's gone crazy. Well, I'm out to go deal with this. Thanks for helping out. I'll kick some credits your way. May not be much. I'm not made of money around here. You might want to give Miss Alpin some time to get clean data. Might be a research. Well, it might prove useful. We're not made of money around here, as I'm given a larger quest reward than most other quests in the game so far. Yep, another 24 hours. Can I have a house warm? That's what Mr. Tate is working on. We'll have to move out when construction begins. A for real house, like the ones in the core? <laughs> it's not going to be a manor house, honey. But four walls, a roof, floor. Can RG move in with us? Maybe. Mr. Tate says he's starting with four houses, so we'll have neighbors. This is so cool! We're All gonna have I a need house is work with to pick actual up, walls. And things may really turn around. Hi, how you doing? Okay. So, um, we're actually early to end the we episode. Can pop on over to Neon and deliver that star parcel package. Yeah, I think that probably does make the most sense. No, it's actually... Yeah, spaceport. Yeah. And we haven't spent the perk from leveling up. No, we haven't. But remember, I wanted a perk for piloting, mm. and I haven't shot enough things yet. The effort to make this place livable is astounding. There's no end to what can be accomplished when there are credits to be made. Got anything you need to offload? Need some work done? I've got an urgent star parcel delivered for you. Ignore the fact that I've taken like two days to get mm -hmm. here. You the courier? I've been expecting you. Star Parcel has your payment right here. Anything else you need? Yay, I doubled my money. Well, less because I just gained another quest reward, but... Okay. Well, we've done that much. I guess we can set up for whatever we do next, but... Oops. Maybe just go somewhere and get into a space battle? How many per... Uh, I think I need many still, isn't it? Yeah, I need another 11. Yeah. 
That's oh, the you problem. have two skill points. Oh, okay. Well, then I can spend one of them at least. Uh, I need one more perk point over here in order to be able to get to the final tier. I need four more for this tier. Aha, combat. Three more in order to get to this tier. And I have not taken enough fall damage to gymnastics. I thought I had taken a perk in environmental engineering last time. Or conditioning, not engineering. <laughs> Although, honestly, I don't even know if that's all that worth it. Weightlifting? Yeah. Oh, you are so close to... Yes. I mean, that would not take me much effort to do really fast. Are you currently at 75% no. or more? So just pick up some things and run around your ship? Yep. <laughs> Any adventure you can fly away from. Is, is that how the saying goes? Yeah, actually, that is pretty close. Good enough. All right, cargo hold. We are going to pick up all of the resources. Isn't it sprint, not run? So what was the actual trigger on it? Yeah, it's for a distance. Mm -hmm. So, um... You're just running now, not sprinting. There we go. a little bit better on that. Okay, I think I'll go ahead and stop this here then. Hmm? Hope you've enjoyed this internet, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye! Bye. I should save. Yes. Okay, now bye. <laughs>